Last year, I worked hours a week. Six months ago, I used to work in private equity and I was in the direct origination team. Hi, my name is Jacob Phillips and I'm a former junior research analyst at a mid-market private equity company. And I'm currently in my final year studying finance at university. For my industrial placement year, I worked at a mid-market private equity company where I was in the direct origination team looking at companies on a day-to-day -day basis. And in this video, I'm gonna tell you exactly how many hours I worked during the week, and also give a little bit of insight into how many hours different teams work during the week as well, because it does fluctuate quite a lot between the different teams in private equity. So first of all, let me start with how many hours I worked. So I was in the direct origination team and I was as low as they go. I was an industrial placement student. I didn't have any set performance targets, nor did I have a performance bonus, which meant that I had to work extra long hours. I had a fixed rate contract, which gave me my working hours, but then it is kind of assumed that you do work outside of these hours too, if you have any tasks which really need to get done um, that day or during that week. So I was set to do 45 hours per week. This was a typical nine until six, or uh, from Monday until Friday. However, with other commitments going on in the company, with potential live deals going on and projects which really needed to get done, my hours probably looked a little bit more like 50 hours a week. The usual day would start off at 8 to 8.30, finish at 6, 6.30, maybe even 7 some days. So in total, it meant that I was probably working anywhere between 50 and 55 hours per week. But this did really fluctuate depending on the, the season that we were in. Like I said, whether we were looking at a live deal, whether we needed to do loads of work or whether we just didn't have loads of work on at that point in time. It really did depend and I'd say it fluctuated anywhere between 45 hours to 55 hours a week. Now, it is important to note that this is the direct origination team and this was uh, an industrial placement year. So I wasn't being absolutely pushed to the max and I could have definitely worked longer hours. And if I was to compare my hours to people in what we call the investment team, the investment team is responsible for what we call making the deal happen. So building that client relationship and making sure that the private equity company transact and buy that portfolio company, that company that we're looking for. A typical investment team weekly hours, you could see ranging from 50 hours maybe even to 70, 80 hours. I, I personally know people that would work through the night to actually finish at 2 a.m. Um, in the night just because they are working on the live project themselves. That's the difference between the investment team and the direct origination team. The investment team are actually working on that live deal, whereas the direct origination team are just facilitating the investment team in that respect. And that's why in the investment team, you can be working anywhere between 50 to 70, 80 hours. But most of the time it does tend towards the 50 hours, the 55 hours, just because you're not working on a live deal all of the time. So I'd say the investment team is definitely the team which works the most amount of hours. And if we were to flip this to another team in private equity, the strategy team, when the strategy team is responsible for basically delivering on the strategy in that portfolio company that the investment team has devised. Uh, if you want to learn more about that, please click on this video. I, I walked through all of the teams in private equity, what they do and their roles and responsibilities and where they sit within the private equity company. So go ahead and watch that video. But anyway, the strategy team are probably doing similar-ish hours to the investment team, but it's more consistent. They're probably doing 55 to 60 hours per week consistently and it's not changing much at all. And they may be putting out a few fires, but it does pretty much remain in that category there. So that's a very quick summary of the hours that I used to work personally in private equity and also the different teams that are operating in private equity. I actually did a YouTube short, which you can watch here, which is me actually breaking down how many hours I did per day. Anyway, thank you for watching this video. Please like and subscribe to see more. Thanks for watching.